Greetings and hello, welcome back to the Druid class campaign for World of Warcraft Legion. Today we're getting the Claws of Ursoc. Uh, forged from Titan Steel by the Titanic Watcher Keeper Freya, the Claws were a gift to the Bear Ursoc, one of the Wild Gods, or Demigods as they are referred to. This is the Guardian Druid artifact, which means we're probably going to have to change into Guardian spec. Nature's gifts You've proven yourself to be everywhere. a druid without equal, but if we are to succeed in our battles against the Burning Legion, you need to take advantage of every opportunity to stay ahead of our foes. You should consider obtaining one final weapon of the Ancients. Its powers will maximize your ability to adapt to whatever the Legion can throw our way. And remember, the druids are the most versatile and adaptable uh, class. And let me know how you would like to proceed. Go with this scenarios. is the only Bless. remaining artifact we can choose. The Claws of Ursoc, the mighty bear god. Ursoc died during the War of the Ancients, defending Azeroth from the Burning Legion. The fearsome claws he bore into battle were placed within the Emerald Dream for safekeeping. There his spirit still guards over them. If you can obtain the claws, they would be a valuable asset in our battle against the Legion. Alright, let's select these. And yes, the quest is designed for Guardian Druid, which means we will be defending. Oh yes. We are nature's guardians. A sound choice. Walk in peace. Indeed. Do you need my The aid? great forest guardian Ursoc gave his life for this world 10,000 years ago. After the Druid's death, his claws were hidden away, safe from any who would use their powers for evil. Leia Stonepaw and her druids of the Claw consider Ursoc their paragon and decide uh, dedicate their lives to following in his example. If anyone would know where the Claws reside, it would be Leia. She and her druids of the Claw reside in the Tel Andu Baroden, just to the north. May your trail be clear. So just like we did back in the uh, Back in the previous episode, we go into, well not in the previous episode, when the Gahanir episode, we go into the Barrow Dens. As you can see, I can't use my Fangs of Ashermane in this form, which means we'll be using this weapon again, the Dream Grow Spire. And in the last episode we learned where to get this one, uh, we learned that the vendor actually goes back and forth into this house here, to the right of the Moonwell. As you can see now she's coming out, proving the point! Uh, she sells the these weapons you can use. All right, uh, it's time we go oh, go into the dens, which are just below us. In here, and down here by the giant statue of the bear, we find Leia Stonepaw. You're not one of my pack. What brings you to the den? Oh, I could use a bit of sleep. The claws of Ursoc. I thought I'd go to the rest of my days without hearing of them again. Is our situation truly so dire? They were sealed away for good reason. It is said that the fragments of Ursoc's spirit, is, his fury and rage, remained within the claws after his death. Only those who have attained mastery of discipline have any hope of wielding them without being overwhelmed by the bear god, the bear lord's fury. Leia looks intently at you for a moment, but you are no novice. I can see that clearly. Uh, very well. Draw water from the moon well. On the northern edge of the grove, then come to me. I'll await your arrival within the broken stump of Vordrasil in North Rend. Yeah, the yeah. Moonwell water is essential. Don't leave the Dream Grove without it. I'll await your arrival in Grizzly Hills. Now, as we did in the Gahanir quest, we are going to go up here and get some Moonwell water, as this will allow us to enter the Emerald Dream. Let's grab this one. Now, if you remember from the previous episodes, we talked about these trees spread around the world, um, and this one is in uh, in the Grizzly Hills, which is tied to the great tree Vordrasil. You can see the image here of a tree stump, and the tree has kind of shattered and fallen. And here we are in the Grizzly Hills. Feels good to be back here. You can see there are lots of bears here. A consequence, and the name of course is Grizzly Hills, uh, which is all tied to this tree here. Vordrasil and the great bear god Ursoc. And listen to that music.
This is the Grizzlemaw Cavern, and the Shrine to Ursuk is right here. The Grizzlemaw are Furbolgs. Uh, they are basically descendants of Ursuk and creations of Ursuk. And they are the bear people, if you want some reference. Good to see you've made it. We need only a few more things before we begin. What? Did you get the Moonwell water? It is essential for our task. Excellent. We will need this water to enter the Emerald Dream, but first we need to address the magical wards that protect the claws. When the claws were sealed away, magical wards were placed to prevent anyone from reaching their location. Only the power of a demigod can give us passage through the wards, one such as Ursol, the brother of Ursak. Ursol is a recluse guardian and requires an offering before he will appear to us. Like Ursak, he was worshipped by the Furbolg, but years of war have decimated their tribes and their shaman lay dead. Search the bodies of the fallen for their offerings while I prepare the shrine. Of course. Now if you are curious about the Furbolgs and the story behind Ursal and Ursak, I recommend that you go here to Grizzly Hills and actually do the quest lines here in Vordrasil. These offerings are fashioned from a bear tooth adorned with malachite chips. We find the we found the final ones by looting all of these shaman outside. And we got some of the these crappy items, but also some nice offerings that we can bring into the cave. My strength is yours. Did you get the offerings? Yes, this should work. I hate rummaging through the pockets of the dead. But we need them more than they do. Now, let's begin. Under Thoras Ithil, great Ursul, wise bear of the woods, this daughter of the wilds calls to you. Please accept these humble offerings and grant us an audience. What brings a follower of Cenarius to my lair? This is Ursal, and he looks pretty amazing. The Legion. The glow of Ursal's eyes begin to shine intensely. Yes, I remember clearly that day long ago when my brother fell. Countless demons fell beneath his claws until, through the overwhelming numbers of the enemy, he was overtaking. My brother was a true spirit of the bear. You must prove to me that the spirit of the bear resides within you as well. The first trial will test your might against the strongest of my followers. Show me that you possess the strength of the bear. Ah, that creature unworthy of greater soul! I crush it! No more fight! You are powerful indeed, but strength alone will not impress me. Ursak never backed down from a battle, even when faced with overwhelming odds. If you would take up his claws, you will show me that you possess the same courage. Your next trial will place you against an onslaught of my followers. Defeat all of the spirits and prove that you possess the courage of the bear. Before you awaits your next trial, defeat the spirits and prove you possess the courage of the bear. Magnificent! Your courage is undeniable. A final trial awaits you. Well done. You handled yourself with honor. You've done well so far, yet a single trial remains before I will give you my blessing. You've proven to me your strength and your courage, but do you possess the ability to apply yourself when it matters most? This final trial will reveal all. 
The final trial will not be easy, Druid. Speak with me when you are ready. Are you certain you're ready? This will be the most difficult task. Ursok and I fought as a team. He would strike, and I would guard his side. Together, we were unstoppable. Tell me, is there anyone willing to fight at your side, Druid? I've seen what this hero can do. I will gladly help. Once, during the chaos of an ancient battle, my brother and I became separated. I failed to be at his side when he needed me most. For this trial, you must prove that you can protect those who entrust you with their lives. Show me that you can succeed where I once failed. This one will be your charge. Guard her, or she will quickly be overwhelmed. Very good, champion. The spirit of the bear truly dwells within you. You have passed every trial I placed before you and emerged victorious. You are worthy indeed of my brother's legacy and have earned my blessing. Go, seek out the claws and claim them as your own. Now that we have Ursul's blessing, we can travel into the Emerald Dream and retrieve the claws. Come, let's not waste a single minute. Where shall I strike? Now that we have Ursul's blessing, we can safely pass the magical wards and reach the Claw's resting place. Now we must pass into the dream, lay down before the shrine of Ursul, and drink the moon water you brought earlier, and your spirit will drift enough into the dream. Be careful, the dream can be a dangerous place. Let's bounce. Calm your mind. Let go, and your spirit will enter into the dream. I'll join you soon. We're past the wards, but what's going on here? Could the Let's nightmare get spread to Ursox's lair? Foolish mortals. Soon, this place will belong to the Master! Just wanted to take a moment here and take a look at this whole area because this looks amazing. If you didn't realize, this is a nightmarish version of the Grizzly Hills. And you can see the tree here still stands because it hasn't been destroyed um, inside the dream. Um, as the dream cannot be interfered with from the outside world. Except for this nightmarish stuff. The tentacles, of course, being a throw towards the old gods. And here we see the Shrine of Ursok, uh, the huge bear head. We see another one of these statues. Vile beasts of the nightmare, you will never take my claws! Lord Ursok! Quickly, to his side! I thank you, druids. These abominations of nightmare are relentless. They will stop at nothing to snatch the claws from my lair. Lord Ursok, the Burning Legion has returned. This hero is our best hope to drive back the Legion and the nightmare. But we must have the claws if we are to succeed. We humbly request your aid. The power of your claws could defeat our enemies once and for all. Worthy you may be, but if you would wield my claws to defend this world, 
You must make haste to retrieve them. Even now, I sense more of the enemy approaching. Thank you, mighty Ursok. The ritual I'm about to perform is complicated and will take some time to finish, but it's the only way to drop the barrier. These foes are weak, but fight in numbers. In life, I paid the price for underestimating my enemy. Never again. Creatures of the wild, heed my call. Come to our aid! I heard your call for aid, Great One! Are there any teeny little fuzzy animals in danger? Oh, oh my! Protect our healers and casters, Guardian. We must not let our allies fall. Keep it up, defenders. We will never yield to these invaders. Their blood will burn the very ground where they fall. Don't let them touch our defenders. Control the enemies. You can determine where they fall. We were. The nightmare's corruption has spread to the trees. It is finished! The claws are ours! Hold, Guardian. I feel a chill deep in my spirit. Foolish bear! You've fallen for my trap! What is this sorcery? When I get free, I'll tear out your foul throat, Xavius! No, Ursok. When next you bear your fangs, it will be at my command. I will resist you to my last breath, usurper. Ah, I will never submit to one such as you. I am Lord of the Nightmare! I have been shaped by the powers of the old gods! Tremble before me! Ah! I must go attend to my prize. Malathar, I leave the claws to you. Use them to exterminate this yes, filth. Yes, Lord Xavius. I'd be happy to tear them apart in your name. Ah! The claws! They thirst for blood! Help! These big meanies won't leave me alone! You did it! You got him! We should go. There's nothing left for us here. Let me know when you're ready to leave, and I'll take us back to our bodies in the normal world. We should go. There's nothing left for us here. Let me know when you're ready to leave, and I'll take us back to our bodies in the normal world. I could use a bit of sleep. I owe you my life. If it wasn't for your actions, I'd be dead or worse. That traitor, Savius, may have taken Ursok, but at least we were able to recover the claws. Hope is not lost to us yet. Of course. Archdruid Greathoof will be expecting us, uh, expecting word of the success of our mission. But I'm afraid I must ask you to return alone. I can't rest knowing that Savius has lured Ursok in his clutches. Just the thought of it makes me shake with rage. I'll find where he has been taken if I have to search every corner of Azeroth. Our paths will cross again. Be sure of it. Nature's gifts are everywhere. So, Savius is behind this. A thousand deaths isn't enough of a punishment for that defiler. But you are returned with the claws. That is not an accomplishment that even I could have performed. You are truly the hero we need to face the Legion. Walk in peace. To understand nature is to understand the great cycle of all things. A blooming flower will someday return to the earth to fuel new seeds. 
The sun sets each day to rise again and give new life. Our order is dedicated to understanding and preserving the continuation of this pattern. May your trail be clear. Ah. This is the final artifact, the Claws of Ursok. Ursok, brother of Ursol and guardian of the Furbolg tribes, bearer of the strength of the forest itself. Azeroth will need you. If you do not stand ready, the world may fall. These are fist weapons, intriguingly enough, and as you can see, uh, we can change their appearance if we go into... Oh. Here. Claws of Ursok starts out with a red uh, look like the bear he is, a pale white uh, look like this. We also have a pale and blue version and the black and red which is kind of really cool. Uh, Stone Paw is the upgraded version, a rock hided look. This one looks amazing in my opinion. More of a, um, I guess, grayer version, a green version and a purple one. Avatar of Ursol, you can see to get the appearance of Ursol we just saw here. These are pretty cool. Red and purple one. And fall into the Nightmare, which is their nightmarish version that you can get. And there's a hidden appearance as well, which is which is obtainable in the Twi Emerald Nightmare Raid, I believe. Uh, Ability-wise, we get Rage of the Sleeper and re unleashes the Rage of Ursok for 10 seconds, preventing 25% of all damage you take and reflecting 22,000 nature damage back at your target. That is the current nature damage there. So it's a very nice ability, a reduction of all damage and reflection as well. Iron Claw is our first ability, increasing our armor by 5%, a flat bonus. We can also get Embrace of the Nightmare while Rage of the Sleeper is active, which is this one. Uh, you deal 25% increased damage and gain 25% increased leech, which will basically the more damage you deal, the more you'll heal yourself and are immune to all effects that cause loss of control of your character. Very nice. Adaptive Fur, taking elemental damage, has a chance to grant you 10% damage reduction for 15 seconds against the elements that cause the damage. So uh, this is very nice if you're taking continuous damage from one school of magic. Gory Fur is a uh, other passive. Mangle has a 50% chance to reduce the rage cost of your next Iron Fur or Mark of Ursol. Uh, Mark of Ursol and Iron Fur are the damage reduction spells you have. Iron Fur will give you armor. Mark of Ursol gives you magic defense. That's it for the bear quest. Uh, the druid artifact for uh, the... Guardian specialization. That was the final guardian or the final druid artifact as well. Next time we'll be checking out the remaining quests in the druid uh, gar uh, druid uh, class campaign for Legion. So stick around for those, and also don't forget to check out the rest of the character playthroughs that are in the playlist in the description below and in the annotations right after this. I've been Crudeless, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>